Now, another huge addition coming to Title Update 20 is going to be this brand new exotic rifle called the Vindicator. And it seems to be, uh, or at least it, it's going to be, one of the top tier rifles in the game as soon as it comes out. But the biggest takeaway from the patch notes today is how you can obtain this exotic rifle as soon as the next update goes live. And that is where this video comes in. All right, here we go. What's going on YouTube? Kamikaze Von Doom here with another Division 2 video. So sit back, relax, grab that popcorn. Don't forget to hit that like. Subscribe if you haven't already. And let me know what you think in the comment section below. But in today's video, we're going to talk about the brand new exotic rifle and how to get it. And more importantly, what you need to do before this goes live. That way you can get the exotic day one of next season. So, like they always say, sit back, relax, grab that popcorn, you know the deal. Let's go ahead and jump into it. Now, all of this information is going to be on Twitter, all right? Or X, if you're nasty. That's right. X. So you can follow me over here on X, at Kamikaze Von Doom. I give you all of the information about the Division franchise as a whole before I make a YouTube video. Now, let's jump over here to the patch notes and we will talk about this new exotic. Okay. So first, what is the new exotic? Well, it's right here. Let me highlight it for you. There we go. So the new exotic is called the Vindicator. It is an exotic rifle with the talent or tease assault interface. So while this rifle is scoped in, the weapon will highlight a random body section of the enemy. Now, that highlighted section will have a plus 75% weapon damage buff. Now, also, this exotic rifle will have plus 5 mag size, optimal range stability, and accuracy. So this is the brand new exotic, the Vindicator. <clears throat> now, more importantly, let's go down here to balancing. Show you a few things to, to do. Sounds like the kids are having a lot of fun. All right, so here's the Vindicator. It is getting a plus 10% weapon damage buff and plus 20 RPM buff because it is a exotic MDR. So the MDR is getting an overall buff damage RPM and so will the Vindicator. So we have to test this tomorrow as well. Now, I will be going live tomorrow to show you all of this firsthand, so make sure you have that notification bell on. But check this part out right here. Okay. Boom. Added Vindicator Exotic in the NSA store. That is huge. So this new exotic rifle will be specific, and it's looking like exclusive to... Descent. Now, we do not know until tomorrow how expensive this exotic will be, but that's going to be their way of making you play Descent. Because if you see these top two changes to Descent, here's the other change right here. They added four different outfits to the NSA store as well. So they're going to have exclusive outfits and an exclusive exotic in the NSA store. Not only that, but in the previous patch notes, they said they are adding an exotic cache as well that you can purchase and a reconstructed cache that you'll be able to purchase. So they're making it to where you can stack up on these NSA tokens. And as soon as this update goes live, you'll be able to pick up reconstructed caches, exotic caches, the new exotic Vindicator, and four new outfits. All of these will be in the NSA store. So, let's go back to the game. The NSA store. The only, uh, yeah, the only, there's only one NSA store as far as I know. Let me uh, jump over here. Let's see if there's one over here. But I know uh, of the one right next to the White House. 
Combat simulation program. All right, so active. here's the entrance to descent. Where would the NSA table be for descent? Yeah, it's nowhere to be found. All right, so let's go to the main NSA store. So fast travel to the descent icon right next to the base of ops, and you will see this little table Combat simulation right here. Program active. Now this is your NSA station. Now this is where they are saying all of those things will be added. So if I open this up, you can see it says no items are available in the store. And that's because I already purchased all of the in-game buffs for Descent. So as soon as you buy all of those in-game buffs, it's over. You have nothing else to spend your NSA tokens on until this next update. And that's where this video comes into play. You need to farm for the NSA tokens. You can see right here at the bottom of your screen, I'm at 14,028 NSA tokens. So as soon as this update goes live, I am buying all four outfits and I'm buying that brand new exotic rifle, the Vindicator, best believe. So how do you get these NSA tokens? Well, you have to go into Descent and complete a boss round or floor, if you will. You can either uh, finish a loop and complete a boss floor that way, or if you're lucky, you can see a boss floor in between your loops. Now the boss floors will be an indicator of a skull at the door. So it won't show easy, medium, hard, it'll have a skull and that'll be your high value target. So each of those will drop you NSA tokens. Now it's not a lot, so you will be farming quite a bit. And that's why I'm making this video. You're gonna need to farm Descent quite a bit to get this exotic rifle. And that way you, you won't be mad day one when everyone else has this exotic rifle and you don't have enough tokens to get it. So farm Descent right now, get those NSA tokens up. And I will tell you tomorrow during my live stream exactly how many NSA tokens you need. But uh, yeah, I think that's it. Yeah. That's it for today's video. Now, uh, yeah, I'm just going to relax and uh, get ready for tomorrow's PTS. Remember, I'll be live tomorrow, so have your notifications on. If you found this video helpful or informative in any way, shape, or form, please hit that thumbs up. Support the channel by subscribing. And let me know what you think in the comment section below. But I am Kamikaze Von Doom. Take care of yourself. See you in the next one. Peace.